In a classic episode of the BBC favourite, jewellery specialist Geoffrey Munn exclaimed he can't believe what he saw when he explained the value of the special brooch, which was brought in by a guest who'd been gifted it by her husband. The Antiques Roadshow moment saw both presenter and guest lost for words as they admired the unique item which was revealed to be worth thousands of pounds thanks to its connection with Tsar Nicholas II. Asking the owner of the brooch about how she got it, she explained it was given to her by her husband. That's very good isn't it, because jewelry buying husbands are almost an extinct species, Jeffrey commented. But this is a most beautifully chosen one, and I think it's got a very interesting subliminal message, which is only secondary to what I'm going to tell you next, actually. The 68-year-old continued, in fact, it signifies forever luck and love. Here's a horseshoe for luck, the diamonds are forever, and a little sprig of mistletoe. So, forever luck and love and from your husband, how often does he buy you bits of jewelry? Every now and again I get a little surprise, the guest explained. Jeffrey went on, it's astounding really because I had a look on the back of it earlier and Terry's a series of hallmarks, and they're significant to what I'm going to tell you next. Well this is a sequence of hallmarks, they not only tell me that this brooch was made in Russia in 1900 but Terry's also a hallmark there that tells me that this is made by the most famous goldsmith that ever lived. This is a brooch by Carl Fabergé. Looking stunned and unable to speak, the guest commented, lovely. Jeffrey detailed, and it says 56 because there are 56 parts of pure gold and it's made for the immediate circle of the Emperor and Empress of Russia. They were avid shoppers at Fabergé, and they bought exactly this sort of thing to give away and in this case, it's made of gold and decorated in this very interesting orange-colored enamel and diamonds. And it's a sentimental thing, and it did that job for somebody, perhaps in the circle of Nicholas and Alexandra, but it did that job for you as well, didn't it? Yes replied the brooch owner, smiling and looking ecstatic. Amazing really, Jeffrey added. Can't believe it's happened, I can't believe it's happened to me, it's a wonderful voyage of discovery. Talking about the valuation, he continued, these sort of brooches, because of the context and the excitement of the maker, have been offered at auction and they have fetched as much as £10,000. Really? No, it can't be. The guest stated. I can't see any reason why this wouldn't fetch that, actually, the expert admitted. You have a gem of a jewel, but apparently a gem of a husband as well. The guest grinned, yeah, lucky day, isn't it? Antiques Roadshow is available to watch on BBC iPlayer, 